Hey guys, it's me, Fake Bread. Um, I thought I would actually like vlog today and take you with me. Uh, excuse the angle, but it wasn't happening putting it on my dashboard. And then the cops stop you for anything here. So this will have to do for now. Um, I took off of work today. I had other plans, but they fell through. So we're doing things a little differently. I'm on my way now to get a massage because I really need one. I've been pulling like 10 hour shifts lately. So you can imagine how that feels standing all day. Because in my job, I stand a lot. So I'm going to my friend Madeline's house. She suggested that we do um, massages. And it comes at the best time also because I ended up falling yesterday outside of work. I was walking out and I probably just blame it on being so exhausted. I wasn't paying attention to where I was going. So I was walking out and then before I knew it, I fell. <laughs> and I was like, oh my God, I can't fall on my back because my back is messed up as it is. So I fell, sorry for the shakiness. I fell on my hip, which is good because it's pretty fleshy. So it saved me. Turn left onto Polito Avenue. Um, so yeah. So I woke up really sore. I had other things to do today, and that wasn't gonna happen. So I had to cancel. I mean, early in the morning, I had things to do. Turn right on your other and Avenue. that's it. I'm on my way go get my massage in Fort Lee. Maybe I'll film in there. Maybe I won't. I don't know. This is my first time like filming outside and talking to the camera like outside. So I don't know. But we'll see. So I'm really excited. Full body massage. Fort Lee if you live in the Jersey area. And it's only $35. What? I think the cheapest massage I've gotten was um, 65 Yeah, I think that's it. But 35 for a full one hour body massage. And then if you wanted to throw in um, a foot massage, $45. What? So I'm so excited. I'm probably going to get on Route 80 soon. And after knowing Madeline for what, like a couple years now, I still forget sometimes how to get to her house because there's so many routes. So that's why I have my GPS thingy on my phone going. So I'm going to get back to you later. And then when I get there, I'll probably film some more. Bye! I'm at Madeline's house and look who's waiting for me. She has an adorable cat named Foxy. He is the sweetest thing ever. Oh my gosh. What jarbs? Hi guys. Hi. Hi Sparky. Hi. The cutest cat ever. Foxy! The cutest cat ever. The dogs bully him, so sad. Yay, we're on our way now. So yeah, I'm massages. I'm so excited. Madeline's here, but she's not about that life, so I'm not going to film her. <laughs> but she's providing the soundtrack. So, I'll probably film after we get back. Now 
I'm filming again with Madeline. I had to delete that clip. <laughs> um, we just got done with our massages. Um, it was really good. $35 and we got a full hour. Um, I have to say, I didn't tell this to Madeline, but at one point I wanted to like scream because when she was doing my neck, she kept pressing on my bone or something. Maybe she thought it was a knot, and at one point I had to be like, no, it hurts, it hurts. And she's like, sorry, sorry. It's probably a knot. Pro it did. Really it's tight knot. And you thought oh it was a bone. Oh, God. It's horrible. It is. I didn't, I didn't think I had any tension. My camera's shaking. This <laughs> pothole's on. I know. <laughs> um, I didn't think I had any tension in my neck, but... I mean, I feel good. And then when she got to my hips, especially the hip that I fell on yesterday, that hurt so bad. Normally, I'm not that sensitive when it comes to, like, pressure and massage. But, I mean, she was rough. For, like, a little Asian woman, she was pretty rough. So, I give her credit. So, now I'm going to go get food to cook for everyone later. But... I might change my mind just because it's five o'clock now. I didn't realize the time we got started late. We were waiting for at least 20 minutes before it started, right? And there was like massive, a half hour. And there were massive people there. I mean, for $35 for an hour massage, you can't beat it. So of course there's gonna be people there. But, um, so I'm gonna see what I can come up with. I was thinking of like roasted chicken and roasted potatoes, but we'll see. So, let's see what I come up with. Look so how cute know. is that? What? They're bunny flowers, did you see? Oh, very pagan. <laughs> Look how pretty. Um, should I cook? That's why we can't do Oh yeah, that's true. It's huge. Small is too awesome. <laughs> I'm not filming you. <laughs> she really doesn't want to be filmed. I want a really small one. A really small coffee? A really small instant coffee. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not doing it on purpose. It's too big. This makes up to 120 cups of coffee. Cafe Bucelo has like a small one. I'm looking, let me see it here. Um, well, yeah. they had like instant ones. Sorry, sorry. Oh, she can't be filmed. She can't be filmed. She works at a very prestigious job, so if they find out about her YouTube life, oh my god. to get the chicken. Oh my gosh. This is perfect. 402. Look at that. So potatoes, chicken. Stuff? Yes, they need to come out with gluten free stuff. I used to live off those things. Oh, this latte one is only two points. Not that I need to fill my freezer. This must be the ethnic aisle. Oh, look at that! Gluten free flax. All natural. You're, you're officially in the video. You put your hand there. <laughs> oh, 
so I can celebrate Passover like everyone else. Look, this Stop and Shop has like a whole gluten-free prepared cake thing. Cake aisle, I guess. And look at that. A whole cake. I feel like I want to get this and everyone should eat it. That wouldn't be fair. But I'm being selfish. These things are like $15 though. I don't want it for myself. But that looks so pretty. This one's chocolate ice layer cake and then this one I don't know where to put this oh <gasps> what gluten free mini rolls oh my god I'm gonna die this is mine I'll probably make a video on gluten free stuff soon which I haven't talked about yet I'm talking about all this gluten free stuff and I didn't make a video on that yet so people are gonna be like what so I found what I'm gonna get Look, they have gluten-free mini Swiss rolls. Okay. I'm probably going to tell you to come and get me stuff. Well, should I get... They have, um... I don't know where to put... Should I get the frozen pizza? Yeah, sure. So I guess I'm cooking. So how long do you... That guy had the right turning signal when he went left. That Horrible. Horrible. I always say a little prayer before I get in the car with Madeline. You saw him. He had a right turn signal. He went left. Yes. That's... What's he doing? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, oh my gosh. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, he was backing up to let that guy pass. But that oh, was... That's like, stupid. See, that guy could wait. <laughs> that's an idiot. Kind of <laughs> that, so, that was weird. Very weird. So... We're like five minutes away from the house. We'll be okay. But I have oh, a... Is Acura who I almost hit and then <laughs> So let's oh. see what I can do in a half hour. I'm definitely going to need wine. But Madeline told me you're not supposed to drink wine after. Well, um, should, they recommend not to drink right after massage. And they messed up my makeup too. So I don't wear a lot today anyway. Okay, my eyebrows. Oh my god. When she went to go like do my forehead, I was like, no, my eyebrows. And I see them now and I usually have them a certain way. <sighs> ah, person, person. Oh my god. Oh my I god. was going too fast to stop for me. <laughs> and that is not a crosswalk area. So <laughs> So if you run him over, nothing will happen. No, you shouldn't be crossing there. Oh dear. Oh, do we need to get wine? That's where we're going. Oh, okay. Right. <laughs> and then I have to skip because of you. Yeah. <laughs> Let's keep it kid friendly. I don't like children. Just kidding. <laughs> Madeline's music ranges so from so many different genres. Oh wow. Purple van. <laughs> it's Barney's van. <laughs> Why does it say Bogota if we're in Teaneck? I think it's, it's like a chain of banks. It's not oh. just one bank. Okay. You're fortunate. You're right next to a hospital. It's right there in the Tolkien team. Now we need to get wine. Irene got wine. Like a big bottle, but that's Moscato. I don't like Moscato, and she doesn't like Moscato. These days, I'm kind of into both. Like I could do sweet, and then I could do that's considered semi-sweet, right? That's considered sweet. Oh, Riesling is semi-sweet. Really? I think so. But what's the one that you always drink? Sauvignon Blanc. That's not sweet. Yeah, and okay. I seem to like that these days. While Madeline's gone, I'm gonna put Britney Spears on. What? 
nothing. Britney Spears, I love Britney Spears. <laughs> If I give you my card, can you go get um, a small bottle of wine? You're not going to come in? It's not a... Okay. I don't know what so, you want. All right. Just come with me. I'm going to come in. Probably going to get a giant one again. Because the other one's a 10. Okay. Um, um, here's a wine for you. Dark horse. Thank you. You need to get... <laughs> I have to get... Um... Get um... I think they have a... The Sutter Home, the arsenic wine. The Chardonnay there. That should be good enough, cheap enough to. Yeah, I'll do that one. No, which one's better? Like, which one's drier? Chardonnays. All right, so. I'm looking for a small. Supposedly this has arsenic in it, but I'm gluten free, so yellow. So it's almost six o'clock and I'm still not done yet. But this is my drunken chicken. I put garlic, oregano, adobo, when you're in a bind that helps a lot, and a lot of chardonnay, and then I'm making potato wedges, I can't wait to see how this turns out. Okay, so now I'm just filming Irene's hands because she's another one that doesn't want to be filmed. She has a prestigious job and she can't be filmed like Madeline. Maddie's like, I need permission. <laughs> no, you should see. I put it up there. I'm like, she's too prestigious. So she's making broccoli tots. But since I'm gluten free, she's doing it with tortillas. And they're only two dollars. No. They are corn, no. right? <laughs> you imagine they're corn. <laughs> I've been eating them, and oh my god! No, no they're, they're corn. Friend. They're corn. Okay. They're corn Bruh. tortillas. <laughs> are we serious? Now? Some well, things we are masked if as corn. Uh, look, look at the ingredients. Corn. It said gluten free. I asked her the corn flour, and she started to panic. We saw the gluten free. Not funny. Can I film you or no? I made some yes. like. Thank you, Bria! <laughs> Wait, we should at, have, and these, it's 7 o'clock. I started purposely, at 6. These names have been purposely changed. <laughs> right? I know. Like, someone shows up at your house. Well. Oh my God, I love broccoli. So, you boil the broccoli. Or you can get these steam in a bag ones. Oh, steam in a bag. Thanks, Bria, for blocking the shot. Oh, sorry. I'm going to steal a broccoli because I want one. Oh, we have Madonna. I told you this playlist is on point. Everybody was like, "DJ Madeline's the best." My like, guess, right? Nah, she's alright. I don't do birthdays. Oh, I need a baby shower. I love broccoli. Oh, I need some ice. Ice, baby. All right, Vanilla. Ice, ice, ice. Oh, I was gonna say, like, Maddie, come on, You're killing me here. Oh, my word. <laughs> Broccoli's delicious. No, I, I saw awesome. all your messages. Where, where is your... There you go. Okay, got now, now we chop the broccoli. Okay. I have some... Oh, look at her. Look at her becoming a chef now on Food Network. <laughs> I have quinoa. Uh, Teresa's not here. Is that the here. same quinoa from last week? Yeah, but it's good. <laughs> Ew. Ew, you're trying to feed his old quinoa. Wait, what are those Goya products? I can't film Madeline. So, what are these? <laughs> wait, wait. Is wait, it? hold up. Why What's do you this? use your coffee filters? Yucca? Why? Is there a reason? Frozen yeah, yucca. What does it do? I don't know. Is it fresh? What? No. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Maybe no humidity? So it doesn't get all, like, nasty. Oh. Is that too good to you must ask your mother why she freezes it. I don't know. Yeah. I'm making it up here. So oh, I know. There's a reason. Oh, my gosh. She cuts so professionally. Oh, my God. Hey, Maddie. Do you guys have green beans? <laughs> so, this is going to get a knife in their forehead. This is a cup of ice. That's a lot of green beans. That's a lot of green beans. Can you see the ice cream? Yeah, but I mean, you know, it's ice cream. Wait, is that what it is next to the green beans? Could this green bean get any bigger? <laughs> Those green beans are good for Armageddon. <laughs> no, no, great tribulation. Right, right, right. Rock, she has broccoli. Like ten what? Oh, why? Long. Why are you not sharing? I, saw, I didn't buy that. And a little bag of venom on me. <laughs> <laughs> Just a little bag. We don't want to go crazy now. 
Okay, so now you're chopping up the broccoli and putting it in eggs? Two eggs and two egg whites. Okay. Why, why uh, the egg whites? Uh, just, <laughs> just for healthy? Okay, got it. Just curious. Rocky tops. <laughs> he keeps me. getting in the shot. It's really <laughs> funny. <laughs> hey, Meyer, how loud? Aww. Watch! I think he's taller from the last one I saw. Yeah, seriously, yeah. he's gotten bigger. Now more taller. He's going to be taller than me in like a month. Yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. Andy's like 10 feet tall, and I feel like it's never ending. Tell me about it. They stop by the point. They do stop by the point. 10 feet tall! By 18. No, I'm taking the point. I've done them. I just get really claustrophobic and hot and sweaty in them. Done cooking. You want to get in? That's my little baby Gigi. <laughs> oh no, no! No, you're being hypocritical right now. You're being hypocritical right no, now. No, there's no rule that says that ketchup is. First of all, who puts ketchup on sandwiches? It's gross. Yeah. A lot of people do. Except, 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 for, for, except for, for burgers. Except for burgers. That's, that's a sandwich. sandwich. That's, that's a sandwich. sandwich. That's a 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 sandwich. A sandwich is made with cold cuts. No, a sandwich is made Yo, of meat. Yo, what's up? Oh my meat. god, boo. A meat, oh. <laughs> a, meat, a, meat, a meat that's a little hotter than obviously. You see, yeah, the sandwich is made with meat. What happened? Okay, cold there are different forms. Obviously, there's like an avocado sandwich. A burger sandwich. is a burger. Hence why they're listed separately on a menu. A sandwich is a sandwich. Yes. They're listed yes. separately in a menu. Oh, yes, they are. Look at no. a menu. But sometimes they put soups with sandwiches. Oh, oh, are they the same thing? That's what the company is. That's what the company is. Yeah, but it's not but actually. But still, together. my point here is that why <laughs> can you, listen, why are you, why are you, why are you guys allowed to have ranch on your salad, your sandwiches, and your buffalo hey, wings? Hey, I'm first. I, I don't have ketchup But I cannot have out. my ketchup on my french fries, my roasted potatoes, or my tater tots. I'm not allowed to do that. But you guys, but you guys are allowed to, but you guys are allowed to have your ranch I okay, I have an answer to that. I have an answer to that. I have an answer to that. It's a free country. It's a free country. You can get ketchup. The only thing is you have to walk to get it. No, I'm not saying that. I'm just feeling a little judged right now that I would like some ketchup with my roast. Absolutely, we're passing judgment. Can you stop recording me right now? Absolutely. But hold on. First of all, Dan. That's all the footage I got for today. Um, I ended up coming home early from Madeline's house. I'm a little nasally and I'm not sick, but every time I drink alcohol, I just had wine, I get very congested. I don't know why. But I started feeling really tired because I didn't sleep well last night and I knew I had to drive home. So, if it were up to Madeline, I'd probably sleep over there for, like, the rest of my life, but I can't, so. But it was a good day. I ended up cooking, and once I had wine, and once I ate, I think everything snuck in, and it started getting tired. So, it was a nice little dinner. I enjoyed cooking. It was a nice massage. 
and everything. And then I just came home to log on to YouTube. And I have 50 subscribers. That is amazing. I'm shocked. That was such a nice surprise. Um, I haven't been on consistently. And I just want to say thank you. Oh my god. I'm excited. 50 subscribers means like 50,000 subscribers to me. It's really awesome. And um, I want to thank everyone for even just bothering looking at my videos and my channel. Um, hopefully more to come. Just cool everyday videos. Um, and that's about it. I'm kind of tired. So, I'm just thinking, what else? There's not really much else. You know, from that massage today, I'm kind of sore. Um, the back of my neck, at one point, she kept, like I mentioned before, but she kept, like, digging into my neck. And Madeline was like, no, that's probably a tense knot. And I don't feel like it was a knot. But the top over here is kind of sore. I don't know, which I, that's happened to me before. I'm not really that sensitive when it comes to like massages. I think I'm. It's because I'm sore from work that I was super sensitive today, but especially my neck. But I didn't think I had any tenseness in there, so that's weird. But I'm feeling it now. It's really weird. So, I'm on YouTube now, and I'm going to check videos. It's only 12 in the morning. Everyone was surprised I left early, but I, was, I don't know. I was just feeling so tired. that Wine makes me just very relaxed and tired, and I was like, if I have to drive home like this, there's no way I'm going to make it if I stay later, and I didn't want to sleep over. So... I had to drive home but that's about it I had I took today off so it felt really good it felt really relaxing and then I have tomorrow um off and I don't know I don't know what I'm gonna do tomorrow I'm supposed to plan a baby shower for my co-worker so I'm going to get together with my other co-workers so we could talk about it. Hopefully that'll happen. But I have a lot of stuff going on. I think that's why I'm so tired. But I'll probably talk about it later. But I talked a lot about um, just gluten-free today. And I made a video for it and I still have to edit. But I am allergic to gluten. So I actually bought gluten-free desserts. And everyone ate them. So, I didn't enjoy them as much. Like, I bought a whole package of, like, Swiss rolls, and I was going to take them home and, like, eat them throughout the week. And everyone ate them. But they had their dessert, too, which I can't eat. So, I was actually a little annoyed, but <laughs> I got over it. I'll just go buy more. I was, I was just so happy because... The supermarket close to me, the Stop and Shop, they don't have that little area. Like, it's all kosher, gluten-free, baked goods. And we don't, I don't have that by me. And I have a Stop and Shop literally down the street from me, and I don't have that. So, that's why I was really annoyed. And for me to go up to Teaneck, which is like a half hour away, I'm like, come on, guys. You can eat anything. I can only have gluten-free stuff. <sighs> but I'm over it now. I'm just a little annoying. No one said anything. <laughs> I don't know who ate it, but it's fine. But anyway, I guess that's it for today. Um, if you watch this, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it. I really do. Hopefully more good things will come. Like I said, I have a gluten-free video that I have to edit. I haven't edited. It's just uploaded and it's just sitting there. I have to edit this. I think this will come first. And I have other things that I have to film um, throughout the week. So they'll be coming soon. And 
I have to get it on a consistent schedule, but that will come in time. Again, thank you again for watching, and have a good night. Mm -hmm.